There was new reaction this morning now after the FBI arrested a militia leader accused of detaining migrants at the border at gunpoint. Jonathan Hunt's watching that story from our West Coast Bureau. Jonathan? Good morning, Bill. The man arrested is part of a group that has made no secret of its work, posting videos on Facebook showing their members dressed in military-style uniforms, heavily armed, and rounding up immigrants they find in remote locations. Their vigilante actions have been roundly condemned by the ACLU, by Customs and Border Protection, and by the governor of New Mexico. And over the weekend, in a joint FBI police operation, the group's leader, 69 year old Larry Mitchell Hopkins was arrested near Sunland Park, New Mexico. That is near where the United Constitutional Patriots, as they call themselves, have been based. A friend of ours from the police department came up and just said, hey, can you come talk to us for a little bit? And that was that. And then we heard he was arrested. We didn't know what for. We didn't know what about. The FBI says Mitchell was arrested for being a felon in possession of firearms and ammunition. New Mexico's attorney general saying in a statement, quote, this is a dangerous felon who should not have weapons around children and families. Today's arrest by the FBI indicates clearly that the rule of law should be in the hands of trained law enforcement officials, not armed vigilantes. The group, by the way, announced an emergency on its Facebook page yesterday today in the wake of the arrest and also said both PayPal and GoFundMe had suspended its account, so they're asking for donations again to be sent by check. Hopkins, by the way, Bill, is due to make his first appearance in federal court later today. We'll keep you updated throughout the yes, day on how that goes. Thank Bill. you, sir. Nice to see you, Jonathan Hunt.